a man hunting Bigfoot on camera, the dreadful footage of one of the most haunted places on Earth, the frightening figure caught on a trail camera. These are a few of the things we will look at, so stick to the end. The cameraman finds himself in a situation filled with mixed emotions of worry and excitement. Faced with a mysterious being, possibly Bigfoot, he quickly instructs his loved ones to seek safety indoors while he embarks on a pursuit. Get in the house! Get in the house! The anticipation builds as the large, hairy creature moves cautiously along the side of a forest road, eventually vanishing into the dense foliage. Amidst the pursuit, occasional grunts and ape-like hoots pierce the air, hinting at the creature's presence. These vocalizations could be interpreted as warnings, signaling to the cameraman to back off and maintain distance. The creature's intent becomes clearer through its vocal communication, urging caution on the cameraman's part. The cameraman's decision to heed the warning serves as sound advice considering the creature's imposing size and evident strength. In the beginning of the video, we are immediately drawn to the peculiar movement of a hospital bed. At first glance, one might assume that the bed is being influenced by a gentle breeze or wind. But upon closer observation, it is clear that the movements are erratic and seemingly independent. The lack of movement in the surrounding environment such as twigs or leaves, just emphasizes the unusual nature of the movement. The behavior of the bed suggests a sense of playfulness of an unknown entity. Rather than being a result of external forces, it appears as though the entity itself is actively engaging with the hospital bed. The back and forth rolling motion shows a deliberate action, as if the entity is enjoying the interaction and finding amusement in manipulating the bed. On August 31, 2009, two hikers exploring the Tatra Mountains in Poland unexpectedly came across a fascinating sight, a dark figure standing out against the pristine white snow. The creature, resembling the legendary Bigfoot or Sasquatch, possesses a remarkable size and height. As it descends the rocky terrain, the creature remains unaware of the hiker's presence. The cameraman's reactions demonstrate a mix of curiosity and alarm. Although they consider the possibility that the creature might be a large man, the remote location of the mountains raises questions about how such an individual could have arrived there. On July 28, deep within the darkened halls of Stanley Palace, two intrepid ghost hunters set out on a quest to unravel the mysteries that lay dormant within its haunted confines. Stanley Palace, a 16th century mansion in Chester, England, holds a haunting past. Built on an old priory site, it has a rich history tied to the Civil War and has witnessed paranormal activity. Visitors and volunteers report strange happenings, including disembodied sounds of children, the apparition of James Stanley, 7th Earl of Derby, a malevolent spirit called Blackfriars, and a woman playing the piano. Stanley Palace is a, a supernatural hotspot, just as you can see in this video. As they navigate the haunted location, they become unwitting participants in a chilling encounter. However, it is not until they review the footage later on that they discover a startling revelation. Upon rewinding the recorded footage and zooming in, the ghost hunters notice the presence of a face peering over the balustrade seemingly observing them from above. This glimpse of a ghostly visage confirms the paranormal activity they had suspected during their investigation. The sight of a face appearing unexpectedly, especially in a place known for its haunting, is unnerving. It raises questions about the identity of the apparition and the nature of its connection to Stanley Palace. The orbs floating around right from the beginning also contribute to the ethereal atmosphere. This is an aerial image that will freeze your blood, a colossal snake that stretches menacingly across the frame. 
This was caught by a helicopter surveying the lands of Congo when it caught one of the scariest sight one can find in nature. The green things all around it should be trees. So just compare it to that to understand how insanely big this thing is. The photograph, captured in haunting black and white, intensifies the bone-chilling aura, allowing your mind to fill in the details of the snake's ebony scales and the murky depths it lurks within. The very thought of encountering such a beast sends a tremor of unease. Its sheer magnitude hints at the power and primal force it possesses. How does such a creature survive and thrive in the untamed depths of the Congo? The Congo, with its vast and unexplored wilderness, provides the perfect backdrop for this enigma. Its large forests and untamed rivers serve as a sanctuary for elusive creatures, and many such gigantic creatures have been spotted, not only in Congo, but in many other parts of the world. In the face of this fear-inspiring creatures, you can't help but feel a primal sense of dread. Our suspense thickens as we delve deeper into the photograph, attempting to decipher the enigmatic figure. To unravel its true nature, we had to zoom in quite a bit. We scrutinize the explicit humanoid blur that emerges from the tall, dense crop growth. Could it be a mere human, or does the unearthly setting suggest an extraterrestrial origin? Standing tall and upright, the figure casts an eerie silhouette against the backdrop of the towering crops. Its pallid complexion further adds to its unearthly presence, hinting at an otherworldly origin. The blurry quality of the figure accentuates a sense of swift movement, as if it is traversing the landscape with unparalleled speed. So did the owner of this trail camera catch a cryptid on the move, or is it just some trick of the camera? This is a creepy sight. Well, suffice to say that this crab has made a plan in the absence of other options. The severed head of a doll has taken on new life as we watch in astonishment. A crab, seemingly driven by necessity, has chosen an unconventional refuge in the form of a severed doll's head. Step by step, the crab maneuvers the doll head toward the water's edge, its instinctual need for safety and protection guiding its every move. As the waves lap at the shore, the doll's smile remains intact. Finally, the moment arrives when the crab, having reached the desired destination, emerges from within the doll head and slips gracefully into the water. A trail camera becomes an unsuspecting witness to a captivating battle of territory and survival between a deer and a group of cunning raccoons. The raccoons, opportunistic scavengers of the night, have detected the deer's presence and recognized the potential for a shared feast. However, the deer, possessive of its discovery, refuses to yield its bounty. Suddenly, the deer launches into action. In a display of instinctual determination, it charges at the group of raccoons with surprising agility. Caught off guard by the deer's sudden aggression, the raccoons scatter in a flurry of fur and paws. This trail camera has caught a surprising picture a mother bear, majestic and powerful, tenderly lifts her small cub to peer inside a metal drum. As we observe this enchanting scene, we are captivated by the protective and maternal nature of the mother bear, as well as how human-like her motherly behavior seems. This trail camera captured a comical scene that defies conventional expectations. Behold, a circus act of raccoons unfolds before our eyes, showcasing their ingenuity and the remarkable resilience of these creatures. Four raccoons, seemingly working in harmony, have fashioned themselves into a peculiar tower, each one perched upon the other. It is as if they have formed a makeshift ladder to reach a lofty prize, something tantalizingly out of reach. The Wyoming Police Department recently reviewed their security footage, only to come across an unsettling and disturbing incident. 
The security cameras were set there to see if the police have to prepare for some wildlife encounter, things such as black or grizzly bears, but were for sure not expecting such a haunting sight. In the footage, a deranged figure unexpectedly appeared and deliberately drew attention to itself. The person's looks were chilling as it walked directly in front of the camera, stared directly into the lens, and swiftly moved past it. The footage revealed the person to stick around for a while with a visage that can only be described as demonic and terrifying. Its appearance was far from peaceful or friendly, exuding an aura of malevolence. The person's bold and fearless response to the camera leaves little room for imagination regarding how it might interact with an unsuspecting bystander on the streets. This unnerving sight, caught on security cameras, raises concerns about the potential dangers posed by this unidentified person. Its deliberate act of making its presence known and the eerie manner make it really creepy. Could it be something sinister at play or just someone playing a prank? It is videos like these that make us grateful for technology, so we may be able to spot this famed creature. Apparently someone was randomly flying their drone in the forest during winter and by accident. They claim to have captured some of the best footage of the elusive creature known as Bigfoot. This drone footage leaves us with little comfort. In the case of this Bigfoot creature, its relaxed manner of movement captured on video can be surprising. This observation leaves room for speculation about the true nature of the creature. While its calm demeanor in the footage might suggest a non-aggressive or non-threatening disposition, we should still be on guard. Some individuals may find solace in the fact that technology enables us to document and potentially understand these beings, while others may feel uneasy or uncertain about their presence. Ultimately, the true nature and intentions of these creatures remain unknown. This hospital security camera caught a strange interaction. A police officer can be seen moving around in a calm manner. All the while, two balloons can be seen around. The security guard patrolling the hospital wing appears unfazed by this. He looks in their direction, but rather than straight at them, he seems to look bit more downwards, as if there would be someone holding the balloons. The officer continues down the hall, and the balloons seem to follow him. The officer turns back and stands in place, looking at the balloons, while at the same time the balloons also stop. We can see the officer gesticulating as if he is talking to someone there. Could this officer have seen something we cannot in this video? Could these balloons have been controlled by the apparition of some ghostly figures? Maybe what the officer was seeing were two kids who lost their lives in that ward? This security camera caught some bizarre footage. Under the cover of darkness amidst a tranquil garden, a chilling sight unfolds. The video captures a mysterious woman lurking in the shadows. What is strange is that the house seems to be placed in some remote area as no other lights can be seen. Maybe this is a cabin somewhere in a forest, which makes everything around this footage even creepier. Is this woman a ghostly apparition? Is she bound by the weight of a dark fate, forever trapped in a twisted time loop? Does she wander endlessly, condemned to haunt the garden, and fix her gaze upon the house looming above? It is indeed a strange sight, which would make one instantly think about a ghostly apparition. She moves with an unsettling calmness, each step calculated and deliberate. So what is her purpose there? Is she a lost soul trapped in this area, forever bound to haunt it? Or is this just a prank played by some woman trying to scare off their neighbors? The concept that icebergs are typically larger underneath the water surface than they appear on top is commonly understood, but what is less known is how dangerous they can also be. In the video, the footage captures a few explorers who find themselves in the path of an immense and imposing iceberg. They are getting ready with special gear to climb on it.
they begin climbing it, looking a bit carefree, but little did they know. The iceberg was not stable at all, as they are about to find out. Once the boat starts going away, suddenly, the iceberg starts moving, immediately turning from a still object to a deadly trap. We can see in the clip that the two climbers narrowly manage not to get dragged down and hit by the iceberg flipping. Icebergs are usually formed from fresh water and their weight distribution changes as they melt, causing them to flip, which was almost the death of these guys. Thankfully, their boat was nearby and quickly plucked them uninjured out of the water. Like we've said, the utilization of trail cameras and other technological advancements has provided us with remarkable opportunities to capture rare and captivating moments in nature. One such instance involves two crows discovering an unconventional source of sustenance perched upon a small creature, potentially a baby kangaroo or a young deer. What immediately strikes the observer is the unusual nature of this feeding encounter. The crows, typically known as scavengers, are renowned for feasting on decaying flesh, preferring the remains of deceased animals. However, in this peculiar scenario, they seem to be targeting the living creature beneath them. The evidence of bites and blistering welts on the animal's body reveals that the crows have perhaps previously scavenged on this particular creature. The video captures a moment that challenges our understanding of the natural world, offering a glimpse into the intricate and sometimes surprising interactions between different species. It serves as a reminder that nature, despite its beauty, can also be filled with moments of unpredictability and enigma. The cameraman's decision not to flee when confronted by the colossal bear displays a remarkable level of composure and wisdom. Instead of succumbing to fear, he chooses to capture the majestic and raw beauty of the creature through the lens of his camera. There is an underlying tension, as if the cameraman acknowledges the potential danger he faces, even to the point of capturing his own demise. However, in an unexpected turn of events, the bear displays an uncharacteristically calm demeanor. It settles down beside the cameraman, exuding an aura of tranquility. The sheer presence of this magnificent creature, so close yet seemingly at ease, adds a touch of awe to the scene. As the camera continues to roll, it becomes apparent that the bear is not alone. More bears emerge along the riverbank, creating a captivating tableau of wildlife in their natural habitat. It's a scene that evokes a sense of reverence for the untamed beauty of nature. One evening, the commercial vehicle enforcement police officers stationed at Donner Pass had an unexpected and somewhat comical encounter with a wandering bear. To the officer's surprise, the bear casually opened the front door and strolled right into the office. Unfazed by the vending machine offerings, the bear seemed determined to find something more enticing. Curiously, the office appeared to be unoccupied at the time, allowing the bear to explore freely without interruption. Its visit was brief as it soon departed, leaving behind an amused but perhaps relieved group of officers. The sight of the officers, now emboldened by the bear's departure, venturing out in pursuit of it, adds a touch of lightheartedness to the scene. However, the bear's curiosity wasn't fully satisfied as it returned a few nights later. This time, it sought its midnight feast in a large trash receptacle. It seems that the mundane nature of the police office didn't hold enough allure to entice the bear for a repeat visit. Among the collection of videos on our channel, one stands out as a truly breathtaking spectacle. Set against the backdrop of purple blanketed hills, a heartwarming scene unfolds. The playful interaction of two adorable fox cubs. These young creatures radiate innocence and joy, finding delight in the simplest moments of their youth. The spectators, fortunate enough to witness this extraordinary sight, are granted a rare opportunity to observe the beauty 
of this tender interaction. The cubs do not display signs of fear or aggression. Instead, they remain undeterred, continuing their hillside adventures with unabated enthusiasm. Amidst the slow snow, the owner of this home went out to film something strange around his house. The owner explained that this was not the first time he's seen some kind of creature lurking around his remote house. At first, he believed it was a wolf or a bear looking for a meal, but since it kept happening, he thought it might actually not be it because it seemed like it was consciously stalking him. This is our home. You need to leave. The owner, having had enough of this creature, finally takes a stand. does it really do through this it seems the owner managed to scare off the creature stalking him but the question still remains what was that it certainly did not look like an animal and if my eyes do not deceive me I could make the shape of a human head could it be another cryptid stalking remote parts in search for victims or is it just an animal looking for its prey in this innocent home video a small toddler has managed to grab hold of its mother's phone, innocently enjoying the act of filming itself. The background audio captures the mother's voice, seemingly engaged in a conversation about changing the child's diaper. The baby, naturally unable to hold the phone steady, causes the camera to sway and tilt. However, just as the phone swings around, we get a bizarre sight. At an unusual angle, a dark shadow emerges, lurking in the background of the room. It becomes starkly evident that they were not as alone in the room as they had previously believed. The shadowy figure, previously unnoticed, raises numerous questions about its origin and purpose. Could it be a protective ghost, looking after the kid and mother, or is it a malevolent spirit haunting the house they are in? At the same time, in all that phone swinging, we could have easily mistaken a simple hanging coat or a normal person in a weird light for a shadowy ghost figure. But it is not unusual for such entities to be spotted near children, and I am sure many of you, just like me, know personal stories of such strange sightings. A group of tourists stands in awe as they witness an extraordinary sight unfolding before their eyes. Amidst the swampy marshes, a strange creature emerges, captivating their attention. It looks like a strange crocodile hybrid, like nothing they have ever seen. We can be certain it is a crocodile, however, by the looks of it, it is missing a front leg, and the other front leg might be shorter than it should be. Maybe it is a genetic mutation that made the crocodile be born this way, or it had suffered this terrible injury in an accident or fight. Whatever the case, this crocodile can still be terrifying even with this impairment, as we can see it crawling its way to the water in a snake-like fashion using its tail and back legs a lot in order to gain momentum. Even with such a handicap, I would certainly not want to be anywhere near it. We have mentioned on this channel how grateful society can be for the advent of drones. In yet another example of the invaluable role drones play, a significant moment unfolds along the shores of Loch Ness, 
where one of the world's most enduring legends resides. Hovering above the water, a drone glides smoothly, its camera capturing a familiar shape beneath the surface. The elongated torso and the sinuous neck, reminiscent of countless eyewitness accounts, suggest the presence of the mythical creature that has captivated the imaginations of many, the Loch Ness Monster, also known as Nessie. The creature does seem to resemble the old legends of Nessie, often described as large, with a long neck, and with one or more humps protruding from the water. In this drone clip, we can clearly see the long neck with a big body, but neither mentioned humps. So could it be Nessie. Many believe Nessie is in fact one of the last living dinosaurs, a Pleosaurus. A few who managed to escape the extinction in this part of the world and continue to live and breed in small numbers. As the footage begins, we find ourselves peering down the barrel of a shotgun, the hunter's focused gaze fixed upon a deer and her young calf. Tension grows as the hunter patiently waits for the opportune moment to make his move. But suddenly, the hunter chooses to lower its gun down. At that moment, something magical happens. The majestic doe breaks away from its stance and gracefully walks towards the hunter. Even the hunter did not expect this behavior, as it raised his gun again, maybe thinking he is about to be attacked. In a twisted fate of the encounter, instead of a hunt, it became a beautiful bonding session, the hunter starting to laugh and to pet the doe. <laughs> Perhaps the deer, upon seeing the hunter lower its weapon, realized he meant no harm and decided to show its appreciation for this gesture. But as beautiful as this is, I also need to mention that I have seen such videos before, and from the explanations I've seen, this behavior might have to do with some sort of parasite which upon reaching the nervous system of the animal, it makes it act less cautious and be more prone to engaging in risky behaviors. When it comes to this clip, I choose to believe that the first explanation is the real one. In the midst of a supermarket, where tiled floors and wet floor signs serve as the backdrop, an unexpected sight captures the attention of the cameraman and supposed shop owner, a full-grown grizzly bear, a creature of immense power and strength finds itself amidst the human-made environment, seemingly at home. The owner tells the bear politely that it is time to leave, but the bear does not seem to be minding that as it continues to chew on whatever he found. Time to leave, buddy. Come on. You had enough to eat. Let's go. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Shoo, shoo. The bear seems to feel at home, looking throughout the store. Get out of here, dude. Come on, get out. I'll kick your The bear takes its bounty and leaves to eat it outside, but soon returns for more. He keeps doing that. The candy it has taken not enough to fill its belly. The owner tries to barricade the door at some points, but the bear's insistence is stronger than that. This trail camera caught a fight between a wolf and a wolverine for the remnant of a slain animal. The wolverine, having gotten there first, begins eating, but a wolf, out of nowhere, instantly jumps at the occasions of stealing a good meal from a smaller opponent. The wolverine, as hard as it tried to fight, in the end, had to give up the meal in order to not become the wolf's snack. This trail camera caught another wild encounter, even more mismatched this time than in our previous clip, a squirrel fending off against a snake. But by the looks of it, it is the squirrel who is harassing the snake.
I have no idea what is going on with this squirrel and why it is forcing its luck so much around this snake. Just one bite, and he's a gunner. I could not find the full video of this, but I sure hope the squirrel started reconsidering picking a fight with such an opponent. Something out of the ordinary stands out against the stark backdrop of a snowy forest. A tree begins to wobble as though being pushed by an invisible force, and then it vanishes. The cameraman is startled and rapidly zooms in to get a better look. Something When another tree appears and joins the ethereal show, amazing things happen. It seems to have been plucked from the earth and is then observed floating weightlessly through the air, as if propelled there by supernatural forces. The cameraman's voice cracks with awe and amusement as he exits the scene. As the screen fades to black, the mystery remains, leaving us to wonder about the invisible forces at work in the world. Could the tree have been uprooted by the mysterious Bigfoot, whose existence has been a mystery to humans for centuries? During a Facebook Live session, the streamer discloses that unusual things have been happening in the backyard of his house. He opens the door to his backyard and records as he tries to stabilize his camera phone. As he closely zooms into the further backyard, what we see runs a chill behind our backs. The figure suddenly appears, emerging from the deepest shadows. It moved with an unnerving swiftness, resembling a cryptid straight out of folklore. Its elongated limbs blurred as it ran past the lamplight through the blackness, leaving a lingering chill in its wake. We can look at the stabilized video and we can see the immense stature of the figure. Even with a costume, no one would be able to look this huge and move this smoothly. Even the comments from the viewers, which were filled with astonishment and amazement, poured over the screen of his phone in a continuous stream. Is it a harmless joke, or may something more sinister be at work here? This driver had just left a late night party and was coming home when he noticed something unusual. The footage from the dashboard camera shows a perplexing image that is concentrated at the side of the road where a deer can be seen standing still in its tracks and commanding attention. But what really sent chills was the ghostly figure that stood beside the deer, an eerie white silhouette mirroring the height and form of a human who stood there, defying the boundaries of the known. After closely zooming and stabilizing the image, it appeared as though the ghost form was gently petting the deer. The footage reveals a spine-chilling moment. What caused this footage, and why does it look like a human close to the deer? Was it a ghostly figure, or a trick of the camera? Nestled within the depths of Guatemala, a park ranger discovers that he is caught up in an intricate web of unexplained occurrences. As the ranger emerges from his cabin, and as he approaches his quad bike, we hear an eerie symphony of unease permeating the air around him. Once more, the ghostly wails can be heard resonating with persistence. Because the park ranger is familiar with the native creatures residing there, he is confident that the eerie howls are coming from a creature that is not native to that area and does not belong there. This leaves the ranger wondering if the cries are of an animal or something more sinister. This trail camera captured this eerie footage in the depths of the wilderness. The grainy image reveals a creature its familiar and inexplicably uncanny form. The creature in the footage has since been named the Tihachapi Dogman. At first glance, the shadow appears to be a normal wolf, but upon closer scrutiny, 
its presence seems more immense than any canine entity. A stooped bipedal person with a slumped posture came into view. The creature's form suggests something more menacing, defying the boundaries of the natural world. Holy f The footage of this giant sea creature was caught on the coast of Madagascar. What we can see from the top of this boat through the clear water must be a gigantic whale, but many people claimed it looked like a megalodon, the long-gone gigantic shark. As unlikely for that sea creature to be a megalodon rather than a giant whale, we can still be left with a feeling of awe at the sheer power and size of nature. This cameraman caught a surprising encounter. We witness a herd of deer as they are grazing. We then see a wild goat. Without warning, it charges headlong toward one of the deer. There is a vicious battle between the two as each one of them tries to outpower the other. One of the deer's antlers accidentally catches the white ram off guard in one of its legs, and the ram is awkwardly subdued to the ground. The ram understands the tides have turned against it. In a swift act of survival, it makes a desperate retreat. The deer then gives a chase, determined to pursue its conquered foe. This trail camera caught some incredible footage of the wildlife in this area. A tiger gracefully comes into view and wanders around. It then notices the trail camera, and out of curiosity, it approaches the camera It is intrigued by it and sniffs it. As soon as the tiger goes away, a squirrel hops into view, darting across the cliff floor. With a quick flick of its tail, it scampers away behind a dappled rock. Soon, a trio of brown bears emerges in a single file. They pause as their eyes fixate on the valley. All kinds of creatures seem to have been caught by this well-placed trail camera, which gives us an insight into just how rich our forests are in terms of amazing creatures. In Kings Beach, California, an extraordinary incident unfolded. Working during a shift at a local gas station, Paul, the shop owner, is met by an uninvited guest. Through the security footage, we see the automatic doors opening and revealing a pretty large bear strolling into the shop courageously. Paul steps forward and blocks the bear's path, but the bear lunges towards him, sending Paul stumbling in sheer fright. The bear reaches one of the store's aisles within the gas station store, and its attention is drawn to a bag of Snickers. The bear then rushes out of the store. But that was not the end of it. On another night in the same store, it was Paul's fellow colleague, Dave, who witnessed a similar occurrence. This time the bear came, lay on the floor, and ate a whole box of three musketeer. Dave has difficulty getting the bear out of the store and decides to call for reinforcements. When the authorities arrive, the bear realizes he is in trouble and is ready to leave but not before grabbing another snack. These strange night visits stopped only once the bear was captured due to it being a danger to the public. But thankfully, the bear was caught only to be released somewhere far away in the wilderness. Within the confines of a residential neighborhood, one of the residents takes a video of a captivating scene. This young bear seems to enjoy having a nice stroll around the neighborhood, at the same time that the bear is making its way towards the corner of the house, an unsuspecting man emerges from the opposite side of the house. His path is destined to converge with the bears. When they finally come face to face, they immediately attempt to get as far away from each other as possible in order to protect themselves. The bear flees for a moment but then it comes back to the same path 
that the man had taken to seek safety. If you want to see more interesting footage, then watch this.